Here's today's In Touch devotion. Today's scripture reading is Psalm 62. My soul waits in silence for God alone. From Him comes my salvation. He alone is my rock and my salvation, my stronghold. I will not be greatly shaken. How long will you attack a man that you may murder him, all of you, like a leaning wall, like a tottering fence? They have planned only to thrust him down from his high position. They delight in falsehood. They bless with their mouth, but inwardly they curse. My soul, wait in silence for God alone, for my hope is from Him. He alone is my rock and my salvation, my refuge. I will not be shaken. My salvation and my glory rest on God, the rock of my strength. My refuge is in God. Trust in Him at all times, you people. Pour out your hearts before Him. God is a refuge for us. People of low standing are only breath, and people of rank are a lie. In the balances, they go up. Together they are lighter than breath. Do not trust in oppression, and do not vainly rely on robbery. If wealth increases, do not set your heart on it. God has spoken once, twice I have heard this, that power belongs to God, and faithfulness is yours, Lord, for you reward a person according to his work. At certain moments throughout history, God literally shook the earth. The ground quaked as His Son died on the cross, and there will be an even greater upheaval in the future when Christ returns. But even in our present day, the Lord often lets the various foundations of our world shake, whether political alliances, financial systems, or other forms of human security. That's when we can see the flimsiness of the institutions on which we've based our hopes. Not to mention that our personal lives can also be rocked by financial crises, relational conflicts, illness, or loss. If we've relied on the fragile footing of human wisdom, achievement, or pride, things may look good for a while, but a weak foundation cannot withstand the storms of life. The believer, however, can have peace even in the midst of instability. That's because those of us who are Christians know that God always has a purpose for the upheavals He allows to occur. Hardships have a way of shaking us out of our apathy and self-centeredness, and they serve as reminders to not trust in ourselves or the temporary institutions of this world. There is only one secure foundation, a humble, saving relationship with Jesus Christ, which will carry us through any and all turmoil. <music> 